In this video, I make a light fixture for a vivarium. The day-night cycle is automatically controlled using a Raspberry Pi, but it can also be turned on and off using a mobile app. I start by cutting metal strips on which the light panel will be mounted. The sharp edges are filed off and the strips are bent. They are then screwed into place at the top of the vivarium. The lights are attached to wooden panels and these wooden panels are mounted on the metal strips. A hole is cut into the panel where an internal fan will be mounted. Support for the light fixtures and the cover panels are glued into place. Holes are drilled for the wires. The pieces are glued together to make one long light fixture spanning the whole of the vivarium. Everything, including the metal strips, gets two coats of black paint. This is followed by three coats of clear lacquer. Cured lacquer are drilled out of the holes. A total of 14 ceramic light fixtures are screwed into place. All the lights are connected in parallel, starting with the live wire. The connections are covered with shrink tube and heated with a hair dryer. Neutral wires are connected to the lights in three sets, and all the ends are connected to a screw terminal. The jungle of wires are held in place with a bit of hot glue. Next, the light bulbs are screwed in. The connection of each set of lights is carefully tested. Each light is also tested to see that there is no fault in the parallel wiring. The cover panels are then screwed in place. Once the vivarium was assembled, the completed light fixture, including the fan, was mounted in place. four wires were connected to the light panel. To tidy up the wiring, more shrink tube was used. Large cable ties were screwed to the back of the vivarium to hold all the cables in place. The wires were connected to a relay that was in turn connected to a Raspberry Pi and the mains. The Raspberry Pi controls the light switches, but more on this in a subsequent video. The 14 light bulbs provide a total of 5800 lumens across the vivarium. This provides a surface luminance of approximately 2500 to 3000 lux at the soil level. The color temperature of the lights is 6400 Kelvin. Thanks for watching.